All right, we're back working on the Jeep today. The, uh, um, as we showed last time, uh, we got the seats out, or we got the platform out, we got the box out, and we got everything cleaned up. So as you can see, we're all nice and clean, and uh, we're gonna try and get the back seat in today. So the first, uh, the first step is to get the 60% um, uh, seat in. That's gotta go in first. Uh, before we put the 40% uh, in because the 40% bolts into that space. So we're going to get everything prepared. I already got the seat out of the garage and hopefully it should go pretty quickly. All right, the first step is we got to get all these bolts out. So we're going to stop those right there. should take care of all the bolts that we need. All right, so you can see we have the stud right there that the back plate's got to fit on, and then this one goes where the bolt hole is. And then this one that we took out down here is for where the seat belts go together, and I'll show you that once we flip the seats up. But that's got to go in first, these two, and then we'll get... Uh, the floor, the ones on the front floor are mounted, and those are just those two bolts in the pan. We're just going to install everything loose right now because we don't want anything tight until we get the rest of the bolts in. And we'll go down and show where those feet are for the floor. Make sure you bring the seat belt strap uh, through the front of the seat uh, before you uh, strap it down or bolt it down. All right. So you've got that bolt, that one. Then on the inside, you just have those two floors and it's done. So now the other side, we've got some additional considerations for the back side. You gotta look out for the air hose and some of these wiring pieces. We just want to make sure is isn't in the way when we mount everything. And then we got to bring the seat belt back. All right, so this seat goes in the same way. You have the frame support here, these two bolts, and then it slides on this one. But you have the additional connection bolts here and here that go for uh, to connect the, the seat to this side. So I believe the trick to getting this in 
now that I struggled with it for a minute is to take that seat out or to set it down. There we go. Because you got to have enough space to kind of wiggle it in. And then you get the get that frame piece in place. And then that the bigger bolt uh, so there are two of those, well, then I'll show you here in a second, but two of the, um, two of the, the studs that have nuts on them that I showed you, one of them is for the seat belt and the other is for the actual seat itself. So let me get those put on and then I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right. So. These are the two that I was talking about. This one is the seat connector, and then this one is for the seat belt itself. And then we got that bolt, the nut in the back, and then on the seat, these two arms are what go to the bottom section. All right, so. Like I said, these arms, they just come out like this. They sit right down on the floor of the Jeep. And you just gotta put the bolts in. There it is. So we got seats back in the Jeep now. So with the seats um, in, that's uh, the space that we have to work with. And so uh, we'll get on to uh, figuring out what we want that to look like and contouring a platform to fit in this space. So excited. Okay, so um, it is hot and humid out here, uh, but that took about uh, 25, 25 minutes to get them both in uh, without any trouble. So uh, again, just remember, there's two mounting points in the back to the tub of the floor, two mounting points on the slope side of the body tub, and then two mounting points on the floor uh, for the 60% side. And then there's one mounting point on the 40% side on the tub, one on the 45 degree slope as the tub comes down, one that connects to the 60 degree seat. The one below that is for the seat belt. And then you've got two on the floor. And uh, so now we have uh, all our seats back in the Jeep. So um, simple install. Uh, next, I'm gonna cool off. In the next video, we're gonna go through uh, looking at how the back's gonna uh, come together. So I'm um, excited to get the seats back in. And uh, yeah, uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Uh, this is Dan from Fisher Jeep Adventures. Please like, subscribe, leave me a comment. And uh, if you do, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks.